Welcome everyone. MFGF Events is a Scottish-based festival company who specialise in beer and gin festivals around the UK. We've recently branched out into e-commerce and retail markets for specialist drinks using data gathered from our festivals. Starting back out in 2014 with the traditional token-based bars with cash purchase points throughout the festivals, we ran on the token-based bars for four years throughout the festivals. Knowing that the event industry was changing with the introduction of various cashless payment solutions on the market, we wanted to step ahead and introduce new technology to our events and keep up with the digital age. This is where we discovered TicketCo and signed up to their event technology after a trip out to Norway to see it all in action. Thank you, Mongo. Um, my name is Carl. See if I can fit up here with you, Mongo. If, uh, maybe I should stay here, I don't know. <laughs> I'm from Norway. Uh, I'm the co-founder of uh, a company called Ticket Co. Started in 2012. Um, I fell in love with the event industry when I was 16. I was doing parties at my parents' house when they were away and taking money in the door. It was a good, uh, good start. It led me into where, where I am today, maybe. I don't know. Um, then uh, I started renting cruise ships when I was 19 to finance my business studies and uh, running restaurants when I was 22, did that for eight years. Uh, I don't know how many events I've done, um, but uh, it's been, it's, it's been um, a lot of them, concerts, uh, festivals, etc. Um, when we started Tikiko in 2012, uh, we wanted to help organizers. Back then in Norway, you had to fax in uh, a form to get your event on sale. And I had to do the same when I did the student cruises, send shipping students from Norway to the UK. It was not a big success, but, but still, it was fun. Uh, and that was exactly when the iPhone came. And at the same time, Spotify came. And a friend of mine in Sweden started a company called iSettle. And he wanted to democratize uh, the card payments in the, for small uh, enterprises. And we went on the same mission. We wanted to democ uh, democratize payments. And when I'm here today, I see a lot of uh, opportunities. And I also see a lot of benefits in terms of using a complete payment solution. Because when you're able to track every payment the audience do at an event, you're able to get data that has not been possible before, which means that you can uh, give them the right context, they can have complete control of their spending, uh, which is extremely important. So we're a complete payment platform for the event industry. And what comes out of that is, is, a, is a big amount of data. We handle all payments in every sort. And one example is Mongo here, who contacted us in our London office, um, wanting to digitalize his events. So we tr traveled up there and, and met him and took him to Norway. You saw the pictures from Norway here today. Thank you, Nick, for Showing, showing the country. I came here today, it was, uh, it was raining. A little bit like when I look out that window, it reminds me a little bit of home, dark and rain. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I guess, uh, Mongo, you're the person who, who got in touch with us and it will be super interesting to hear how digitalizing your events uh, has helped you with your cost savings and control, which is also super important. Thank you, Carl. Yeah, so after reaching out to TicketCo, we've seen loads of benefits from utilizing the system throughout our events. One of the things has been that it's led to our reserved stock controlling ordering process leading up to festivals because we can know through the data what's been saying well, what's not been saying well, so we know what to order, which ultimately leads to a smarter buying process which increases our revenue as we don't have unused stock sitting in storage. We've used the cashless data and stock features to review products which are popular throughout the festivals. Due to this data being live and accessible instantly, we've been able to reorder during events products that we know are selling well and are due to sell out. This means ultimately that profit is buying, so the more accurate the buying, the more accurate your profit will be. This also is great to use when we have products, for example in gin festivals, where you'd order a case of gin and throughout couple of festivals, we've only served six serves of one of the gins, so we know that's not 
to um, reorder that product again. One of the most surprising and helpful features of Ticket Co Cash System is the ability to monitor bartenders and bar stock. Although we do trust our staff, the system has helped us to crack down on problems like free drinks being handed out. Staff become wary that how the technology is monitoring them and completely and taking a complete accurate account of money paid in, thus discouraging handing out free stock, at least without checking first. We've also used this element of, sis, of, a, of the system to give staff incentives, such as who served the most drinks over the festivals and awarding them with a small bonus for working hard. This, of course, increases revenue for us and also for the staff as they get a small bonus themselves. Thank you. Sounds good. I think, um, uh, I mean, people like Mungo, uh, I've been working with events myself. I know how hard it is. It's intense, it's risky, etc. And, I mean, if we can help, if, if, if digital solutions in general, like the one in French you, you spoke of, if that can help you get your head around things, that's amazing. And uh, regardless of being ticket co, bots, or any other solutions that can make things easier. Because you have those days where your events ha are running, uh, and that's the most important days of, of the year. Um, do you have any other positive impacts, uh, uh, Mungo, in terms of going digital? Having previously been a token-based festival, we've seen a massive increase in revenue since deploying the Ticket Co system. How, I hear you ask. With tokens, you can't have varied pricing on different drinks and food. With the Ticket Co and their point-of-sale system, every product has its own unique pricing. We used to charge fixed pitch fees for food vendors who attended the festivals, and they would take their own methods of payment. Now, if food vendors wish to be involved with our festivals, we require everyone to be part of the TicketCo system to give all the customers one easy benefit. This also gives us two benefits. It means we can charge a fixed percentage and drive more revenue via food sales. It gives the customer one easy payment system throughout the festival and them not having to worry if vendors take cash or card. Food vendors also find this data invaluable for reordering stocks during the festival as the systems and reports are live to run on sales throughout the day. Also with our e-commerce side of the business, having the data from TicketCo means we can push out newsletters and offers to customers after the festivals on the most popular products, thus increasing our festival revenue after the festivals have taken place online. I think um, if I look at the event industry uh, from the inside, um, people are paying differently all over the world. People are using consuming music in a, in a new way. They're using Spotify to take payments. They're paying for their Netflix account once a month. But when you go to an event, it's like you go into a, a, a shopping center or a store and then you pay to get in with one solution. Then you pay cash at one place. Then you pay cashless maybe with a top-up card in another place. So it becomes incredibly fragmented for the audience as well. So I think having uh, a complete solution for all sales also gives benefits for the, the audience, right? Absolutely. Having started off with our festivals using a different ticketing system and then a different payment system for bars and for the food, we've seen a massive um, benefit speaking to customers when we've integrated everything into the one easy payment solution. With TicketCo's simple app, customers have the benefit of being able to buy their ticket and top up credit all within the one app. Customers appreciate the fact that after they've, after, uh, sorry, customers appreciate the fact they get all their unspent credit refunded through the app and can see all their purchases throughout the festival rather than returning home with a pocket full of tokens. The app is especially useful for us as we can push customers to our high street shop or online shop via push notifications after the festival, driving increased revenue from the drinks that the customers enjoyed at the festival. One of the big benefits we've heard and spoken to customers about is the fact that they don't have to queue. With the benefit of the app, customers can download the app, top up, all from home, so once they've arrived and checked into the festival, they can go straight to the bars and enjoy the festival without having to queue to get their payment method. So it's one easy solution for the customers while they're at the festival. I guess queuing up is, uh, is, is never a good thing, uh, I guess. Um, but I think you're in it for the long term, uh, Mongo. I guess you started this uh, business with a, with a longer purpose as well. Yeah, no, absolutely. Um, I'm a big believer of technology. So t 
since onboarding Ticket Co last year, we've been working with yourself just over a year. We've seen a massive increase in revenue. The reporting system allows us to analyze bar and food sales much quicker rather than having to take um, time counting, counting the cash. Many people think that cash is king, but with the costs and worries of cash, cash security, cash handling fees, using a digital system such as Ticketco is the event industry's way forward. As with the ease of running reports, accounts can be updated in minutes, and all the festival transactions are in our account within two days after the festival has ended. The app, fe the app feature that allows customers to purchase tickets and festival credit at the same time. This enables the customers to spread their budget they will be, that will be used during the festival weekend to be in prepaid festival tickets and, sorry, prepaid festival credit while they buy their ticket. This credit-like model allows the customer to spend more for two reasons. Firstly, they think they've topped up so far in advance, but the time they get to the festival, they feel like they haven't already paid for their food or drinks and their budget, they still have budget to go. Secondly, this feature allows and encourages the customer to save up for the festival, which means they're more able, they're more able to spend the, spread the costs and thus spend more when the festival comes around because they feel that it's prepaid and it's kind of still there to be spent. So overall, having, using cashes now for 10 events, we've seen, and particularly going back to festivals where we've been using Eventbrite as our ticketing system and then using just cashless, speaking to customers, they're delighted that the whole festival system is one easy app because they don't have to worry about cash or card. They can save their cash for the taxi home or the bus home and they've everything works on their smartphone. So um, absolutely, it's a great system. We've been using it for just over a year now. We've used it all across the UK and I'm excited to see some of the developments that Ticketco are bringing out to just improve the system even more. And we have a short video, I think, from our festival in Edinburgh last earlier this year to show you some of this system in action. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I should have uh, done a, uh, a little uh, singing there in the background, just to make some noise. But um, I would like uh, everyone to, to, to try out the system as well. Uh, Joe Hare, that you saw a picture of at Glastonbury, was it a good trip, uh, Joe? Yeah. yeah Recommend people to go? <laughs> good, great. So thank you everyone uh, for listening in. And Mongo, uh, I would love to help you further with your events and I look forward to a good and strong partnership. And if there's anyone who are interested in learning more about how event organizers has gone digital, please let us know. We've done about 45,000 events now, and we have the whole range of event organizers in our portfolio that's happy to talk to you. Thank you. Thank you very much.